Hey guys, in this video, we are going to take a look at the best features of the Lineage OS 17 uh, like we do every year. So, without wasting more time, let's start. So guys, Lineage OS is a close to stock based ROM. A lot of users trust this uh, uh, custom ROM because of the support provided by the team and it's really nice. They provide uh, regular builds. It's uh, sometimes daily, sometimes uh, weekly. It depends on the device. But yeah, also they provide uh, builds of, uh, you know, previous Android versions like Lineage 16, for example, for a longer period of time than other ROMs. So it's the most used one. And here we take a look at the Lineage OS 17.1 features. Uh, like every year we review the Lineage OS features and this time it's the Android 10 based 17.1. Uh, so let's start with it. So guys, the first feature we are going to check out is the uh, hidden and protected apps. It's on the home settings and here you can see uh, you have to set a pattern or password and then you will have the screen uh, you can hide and protect apps as you can see I can hide the browser uh, you can even protect it with your default password then you can even go and protect your uh, gallery if you have some uh, private images or some videos you don't want anyone to see and as you can see uh, your gallery uh, is protected now you can use it with a password and then it will open and then uh, if you want to hide uh, you have to go and check this eye icon how to click this and then it's hidden from the drawer but if you have that app on the uh, home screen it will not hide i don't know the reason but yeah it does not hide from it but it gets locked as you can see the browser has got locked so that's how it works now the next feature is live display it's on the settings display and here we have uh, display adjustments the first is color profile and you can choose between a lot of color profiles i use the normal mode normally then you have cold mode and warm mode and standard which is actually same increased mode uh, i don't know but some things are increased i guess default mode which is set by default and the hall native identity mode you can uh, choose between any of the modes according to your usage now the warm and cold are only uh, thing i uh, think uh, I can you know tune in and I can see the difference but yeah if you know the, about other modes you can check them out then the reading mode will turn your uh, display into grayscale mode uh, which is black and white and then we have color calibration you can change the RGB values here and then picture adjustment to change the use saturation intensity and contrast then under display we also have the legacy app support now by default uh, in the lineage apps only the email app is supported but when you install other apps, it will appear here, which are supported. Now opening the styles and wallpapers app, we have this uh, clock and here we have the lineage or specific clock. When you apply it, it will apply to the lock screen. And this is how it looks. It's cute, but you have to set a proper wallpaper. It's in white, so you can set a black or dark wallpaper to make it look really nice. Then under lock screen display, we have uh, media cover and media visualizer. And this is only for the lock screen as it is under the lock screen display option and you can even disable them if you don't want. If you only want the music visualizer, it is also possible. Then under privacy, we have the lineage trust support. Uh, as you can see, it shows the status of the Selenix info, security patches of both platform and under and encryption. And you can also restrict USB for the new gadgets when the device is locked. Also lineage or statistic support, you can send statistics if you want. SMS message limit and you can change it to uh, 200 and then we also have security alerts which you can disable if you don't want it uh, to be alerting if you change the setting status to permissive while flashing permissive for different mods then you can disable this then it will not annoy you from the uh, notification bar then into system we have buttons customization you can tweak your hardware buttons and you can change the gestures like uh, uh, home double tap home long press and you know also the volume button customizations can be done here and also you can change the volume panel to left if you like in case just want this then we also have a little bit customization related status bar which is quick pull down network traffic monitor then system icons then clock customizations uh, battery customizations and also uh, uh, brightness related customizations you can also hide the auto brightness uh, if you like accidentally take it from here enable it and then you can also enable the brightness control over the status bar which is also a good option to tweak the brightness in here also guys if your device is officially supported by lineage os then you will get the lineage os updater which you can easily download uh, new updates through ot and easily flash them via the custom recovery 
also guys lineage os supports micro g so you can easily install micro g and you can use your favorite apps without google services so that's also really nice there are two more hidden options under developer options which is first one is the advanced restart now with advanced restart you get two more options the bootloader and the recovery which you can easily boot it directly and don't, you don't have to turn off the device and press the buttons so it's a time saving thing now the next feature is the smallest width and you can change the custom dpi of your device with this like if i choose 411 now the custom dpi the display will be uh, gone to 420 uh, as you can see into display you can check the custom dpi and you can also check the values for the custom dpi and what to change in the smallest word on google now that is it for the features of the lineage os 17 if you guys have liked this video don't forget to press the like button also if you don't like it press the dislike button and you can also follow me on instagram the link is in the description also please subscribe this channel and guys take care wear a mask and bye bye